if we did something wrong to someone, even coincidentally or intentionally, we will reap it. Someday, oh, some lives, many hundreds or many thousand years later, it will bear fruit. There is nothing that happens without reason. There must certainly be some antagonism from some previous birth. You see, you understand? Past life, trouble with each other, mm, somehow, uh, accidentally or on purpose. If we did something wrong to someone, even coincidentally or intentionally, we will reap it. Someday, oh, some lives, many hundreds or many thousand years later, it will bear fruit. Like the Buddha said, he just kicked the, um, the head of the dead fish, already dead, just to see if he's still dead <laughs> or not. Then he had headache in the present life when he was Buddha, Sikamoni Buddha. Many other things, yeah? Being in this world, we can never be immune from making karma. That is a problem. If you remember all the stories I read to you about the Buddha's uh, past lives, you will remember. Or maybe many stories I did not tell you. Even the Buddha, who had been Buddhas for eons already, before he became Shakyamuni Buddha, before he keep reincarnating on this planet to make affinity with other beings, before, 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 he had already been a Buddha. That's what he said. Yeah, and that's what it was. But still, when he came back, when he reincarnated as humans, he made many mistakes. Either mm, pro provoked by situation, others or circumstances pushed him to do that many, many times. And then he had to reap the consequences in other lifetime. Even Lord Mahavira, in other previous reincarnations, he had done something also not very uh, benevolently to someone else. Probably that someone else, if we look further, oh, long, 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 long time, far into the uh, existence of all the beings, we will probably see that that being probably had done something to him. And then he, in, in that lifetime, did something back to him, pushed by an inconceivable force of karma that you could not even resist. With all your might, with all your wisdom, with all your knowledge, with all your learned and practiced meditation and uh, virtues, you still had to go with that flow, with the karma. So actually, it is true, it's, it's said here, there's nothing happened without reason, even though we did not see the reason. It's not apparent that this reason caused that thing to happen. No, no. Okay, huh? So in this lifetime, even if we are initiated, and even if we meditate a lot, things still do happen to us sometimes, even though <laughs> lesson to some degree, uh, lubricated <laughs> to some <laughs> extent, we still need to bear it, all right? Even the masters, no exception. Even the Buddhas, no exception. More or less, we do have to pay anything that we incur, any debt that we incur from the past many lifetimes that we don't even remember or even remember. Remember or not, we must pay, <laughs> okay? <laughs>